is about um, doing a few uh, tricks um, when you have, have some issues when you're executing a data services job. Um, sometimes you get an issue, the fill length, and uh, and it actually um, gives you kind of, um, it basically errors out, the, the, pro, the, the execution kind of errors out, and then you can't, and you don't know where it is basically. And some, sometimes it's difficult to debug as well. So for that, for that reason, sometimes um, we need to find a different way to make it um, easy, easily identifiable and uh, bypass that particular issue and then generate a file from the, um, from the transform then trying to upload into a template table, the data set. So let me quickly show you that. So I'm extracting some data from a legacy system and then I have got some issues. Okay, so not, is it here? No. So I was extracting the data from, from this one, for example, right? Um, okay, slow. So if you got an issue, what do you have to do? You come inside this. And there is this overflow handling option here. And it put the file path here. So this overflow handi handling option would let you over write an overflow file which will contain the error data and um your your uploading the of the data of the extracted data would work all right into the target template tables so this is a little trick yeah so remember this uh, use overflow this is the error handling option here and you have to put a file path here which is your data services directory file path that you want to put in yeah that's it so 